Hey guys, amigos, Rafael aquí, Rafael here. So, this is not a repaint. Este no es un, este, uh, como se dice, repintada. Uh, this is a repair. Uh, esta es una, este, compostura. Lo que pasa es que iba a ser una cosa pequeña y resultó que llegó, pe llegó peor. This was going to be a small and kind of easy fix with a small repair, but it looks like it came worse. So, we need to fix this. Vamos a arreglar esto. Holy moly. Okay, let's get started. Vamos a empezar. So first, lo primero, we're going to uh, put this together. Vamos a arreglar eso primero. It's like a puzzle. It's como un rompecabezas. Okay, so here it is. Whoops. Ahí vamos. And right now I'm just using crazy glue. Ahorita nada más voy a usar cola loca. Alright, so here it is. I've marked where I'm going. Well, once this dries, ya cuando se seque bien. And there's still some seam lines because it's, you know, it's bendable kind of, but uh, as we'll be putting some pins, there's certain areas that are thin. I mean, aside that están muy delgadas, but we'll see what we can do. Then we'll go around it with putty. We will ponerle putty. Igual por acá atrás, same in the back. So you have all these little crevices there. Tienen todos como... Sanjitas, these are where the pins will go. Aquí es donde van a ir los, los como clavos. To give it some support. Okay, so I'm just using some nails. Estoy usando unos clavos. Just crazy glue. Usando con la loca. Alright, so here it is. Aquí está. All the pins are in there, and uh, we mixed up some uh, epoxy. Ahí hicimos la mezcla de la pasta. Again, equal amounts, and we are going to start filling it in. Vamos a empezar a llenarlo. Okay, so we'll let this dry. Vamos a dejar esto sacar until then. We'll work on the back. Okay, after sanding it, después de lijarlo un poco, I'm going to uh, primer this just to get an idea how it looks. Voy a ponerle primer nomás para ver cómo se va viendo. Meanwhile, this stuff here needs to dry more. Esta parte se necesita secar más. Um, Okay, so this is the inside, this is adentro. All right, now we're painting it. Vamos a pintarlo. And here we're putting the putty again. Aquí otra vez la pasta. So since this came broken, ya que esto llegó quebrado, I could always put it back the way it was, but any little thing could break it again. Cualquier cosa puede quebrarlo de nuevo. So what I'm going to do is add a magnet here and uh, maybe just have it where the client can just put it in there. And you know, that way it ships easier. And uh, así es más fácil que el se mande por correo, no se quiebra y se pone aquí adentro y no hay problema. Alright, so there's the magnet. Ahí está el imán. Alright, so this is cured. Esto ya está listo. So you just, you know, use the magnet. Okay, so I drilled the hole here. You know, how do I have a magnet in there? I put a magnet in here. So what you do, lo que hacen, put this guy in here like this. And put this guy in here like that. 
and there it is. So let's paint them up. Vamos a pintarlo. All right, we got that going. Uh, ya está ahí. Okay, so here you have it. We got this guy first. Va este primero. And then this. Y luego esto. And there it is. Ya está. Okay, time to finish the apron here. Ya para terminar el... ¿Cómo se llama? El mandilo. Okay. Anyways. Okay, so... Here it is. Let's start painting it. Vamos a empezar a pintarlo. Okay, so uh, this is done. Ya esto está listo. We're going to add some blood. Vamos a echarle la sangre. And my client decided to give these a little bit more realism on there. Uh, quiere que le ponga algo más real ahí. Uh, you know, to make it look more fresh, para que se vea más fresco. Same with here, in this area. Kind of maybe bruise it up a little bit, ponerle como un poco de moretón. More fresh blood, maybe some drips. Y unas cuantas chorreras de sangre. Okay, so we're adding a little bit of purple. Estamos poniéndole un poquito de morado, just to add some bruising. Okay, I'm assuming these things are huge nails. Imagino que esos deben de ser clavos grandísimos. So I don't know why don't, they don't have this kind of a color. So I'm just going to go in with some silver. Ahorita nada más voy a pintarlos de plateado. And then just give it some weathering to kind of try to match these at least. Okay, so right now I'm mixing up 5 minute epoxy. Voy a utilizar este 5 minutos de epoxy. I'm going to add, le voy a aumentar, some Cinema Secrets FX blood or any blood you can get, cualquier sangre que puedan conseguir. And I'm going to mix it into the epoxy. Le voy a mezclar con la epoxy. It'll get a little thick and se empieza a ponerse un poco más espeso. So you kind of want to work fast with this. And little by little, y poco a poco. So. All right, guys, so here he is. Aquí está, amigos. Again, this is magnetic, so you can take it off. It's the iman, así que se puede quitar. And the client decided not to have the blood so fresh, so we dulled it down. El cliente no quiso el, la sangre tan fresca, así que le quitamos el brillo. And also not too fresh on the apron there. Y tampoco tan fresco en esta área. So we also dulled it down. And not so much. Y no tanta sangre. Así que nada más fue esas picadas. Just spatter. Mm. Alright guys. Till next time. Hasta la próxima.